Hey, this is Mikey B. Zan, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to draw classic cartoon shoes and also cartoon animal feet. So, you won't see my face again until the end of the video, but for now, let's go ahead and jump into my drawing tablet. Here we go! First, start out with an oval shape, and then we'll draw some circles. I like to draw a bigger circle for where the front of the shoe is and then a smaller circle overlapping the bigger circle. On the smaller circle is where the ankle is and it's just a small oval shape. This is where the leg or ankle goes into the shoe. And then for the very bottom of the shoe you'll often see another long oval for the sole of the shoe. I don't always draw this but if you have if you want a little more detail you can and that's the basic structure and now I'll do the outline when animating I would simplify the shoe even more I draw an oval like this and then make a little bulge for where the toes will be and then just draw an oval over here for the little socket of where the ankle goes in and I won't even bother drawing the sole of the foot. That little added detail of this kind of oval shape. Just get rid of that. If you were drawing that foot at another angle, like this, like it was stepping down towards us, then you just draw a line inside to show where the bottom of the foot is. And this is just like a streamlined way of making feet. Let's see one kind of in perspective towards us a little bit. For an even more simplified foot, you can start out with an oval, and this is going to be like for a background character. You might just see an oval and their pants covering up the oval, and then just a little floppy toe area here. And you might see like a secondary little flop here. This would be like kind of a goofy character probably, like floppy feet. When I'm drawing animation, like I might just start out with a line for where the foot will be and then just draw two circles. Like I might not even start out with an oval. Sometimes it's easier to just do it like this and then clean it up. So there's a lot of different approaches you can take to drawing feet actually. But the main thing to keep in mind is that feet are basically constructed of two circle shapes. One for the front of the foot and one for the back of the foot and keep in mind that depending on the perspective what angle these ovals will overlap in different ways the lady characters would usually wear shoes with high heels so to do that you would draw this kind of almond type shape the tip of the toe is touching the ground so the back of the foot is raised like this. You have like a little rectangle shape for the heel. And then a smaller oval almond shape inside. That just follows the shape. And then you have one final shape inside here to show the bottom of the foot. Or the bottom of the shoe rather. Of course you wouldn't see this if there was actually a, a foot inside here. That's how you draw a lady shoe. Is It's literally just an almond shape and a rectangle and then another almond shape. Practice drawing shoes at different angles. You can look at live reference photos of shoes and simplify them down to a couple basic shapes. From here you can turn them into the rubber hose style. For an animal foot, you'd have a kind of oval like this. Depending on the species, you might not have any toes, but say it is a species where you're gonna see the toes, you just draw three little toes. The leg where it comes in, you can either have something simple like just a straight line like it's a tube, or what you might wanna do is just add some triangle shapes to show fur. If you were to see this animal foot at say the front angle, you draw kind of like a squashy thing. Uh, 
draw a squash. Yeah, draw an oval. Okay. Draw an oval like this. And the heel. The fur. And you just draw in the toes in perspective like this. And a frog would be something like this. You just take this three toed concept, three toed, three toes concept and apply it to any kind of creature. And you just can adapt it to any type of animal and it reads it as cartoony when you have three. Here's a trick for how to place the toes. Just draw an arching curve over the foot and then when you draw the toe in, that'll show you how far to bring the toe and keep it consistent. Well, this video is over now, but our story doesn't have to end here. On my channel, you will find drawing tutorials animation tutorials, uh, music videos, and so much more. These videos are made with love and care. They are glutton free. They contain no artificial colorings or preservatives. So direct all your comments, questions, and concerns in the comment section. Feel free to thumbs up that like button and uh, thumbs, give a five star review on the subscribe bell and I'll be back with more content.